This is my fall garden getting ready to be planted. The chickens had already done all the work. Tilled, fertilized, debugged, weeded, and even spread in mulch. Now let's do this. What do you see? <laughs> what do you see? What is it? I have no idea what you're seeing. Oh well. Yeah, look who's up with me this morning. Gonna do the chores. You up and had them this morning? Ready to do the chores? <laughs> he sees something. Oh, did you see the crows? Is that what you see? Whoa. <laughs> he dead serious about it. He dead serious about it. All right, let's get, let's get to you in the Ergo. Forgot it in the car yesterday. On the trip to Mount Mitchell. <laughs> you happy back there now, Mr. Brown? So glad. He's starting to like the Ergo again, which I'm very happy about. You ready to let out the turkeys, Mr. Brown? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, here they come. Okay, Mr. Brown, you ready to let out tea bags, Posse? Okay, let's do it. <laughs> Next up, Mr. Brown, the Donald Trump Posse. But we gotta do a special little project today. We're gonna start the process of our fall garden. What we're gonna do today is pull up half of this. So we're gonna cut their area in half. Don't worry, it's only gonna be for two weeks. Cut this area in half and then plant it. Now we're not gonna plant today, hopefully tomorrow. Hey Jenna, hey. how you doing bud? <laughs> you just waking up? You wanna help me move this net? Cool. You get that one, I'll get this one. Good morning, little man. Good morning, little girl. How y'all doing? Good. Did y'all just get up and come straight out here to see me? I appreciate that very much. <laughs> Thank you. This end looks like a heck of a mess, doesn't it? No problem with a few corner posts. Call the inquirer. I think Mr. Brown's saying inside. Meaning, he never wants to go inside. Come on, buddy, you wanna go inside? Okay, let's see. It may be because Grandma's here. There you go. Go see Grandma. Can one of y'all open the door for him? I will. I will too. Thanks, guys. Hey, John, are you still gonna help me? Yeah. Oh, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> okay. I don't know what you want, so I'm gonna go finish, Mr. Brown. He started crying for me when I left. It's hard to understand toddler. Okay, do you wanna go in the chickens? No. You wanna go in there with Donald? No? no. All right. No, no. You want down? There you go. Now, you see this corner where this guy came, there wasn't a pole where we needed a corner, so we're gonna create one with our handy dandy PVC and post. Woo! Now doesn't this look better? Okay, sure, this ring is much smaller. Oh, did you notice that too? I thought it was hilarious. Bobby came over here and he called this thing a ring. I officially have a new name for the electric poultry net. It's the ring for the dinos. All right. We're going to let them out of, our, out of their cage fight this morning. Josiah is eager to do this. He's, cut up. He's caught in here. Let me get you out, buddy. Come on, Brown. Come on. You want in the ring? All right. Let's get in the ring. Woo! All right. Everybody's in. Go. <laughs> 
<laughs> How about your food? Oh shoot, I forgot the food. Hurry, it's gonna be a riot. You better, you better hurry. Uh, come on, Josiah, bring it over. You can do it. Come on, they're gonna get me. Ah, they got me in the corner. You better hurry up. They're gonna have a pitch of fit. Okay, here we go. Hey guys, I'm here, I'm here. It's okay, <laughs> Mr. Brown, right in the middle. Calm as can be. You could almost ride that goose, couldn't you, buddy? Do you see why I feed the chickens first? This gets crazy. <laughs> Last thing we gotta do, guys, this electrical line. It's going down to the cattle lane, getting its energy. Okay, we've opted to roll it up and then reset our posts and then unroll it back. Okay, we've got our new fence line in. Let's unwind the spool of wire onto it. That should do it. Now all I gotta do is plug it in. Good morning. Good morning. Rebecca. You look very nice this morning. Yeah. No wonder I call you the beautiful one. <laughs> it's true. And this is where you must get it from. Grandma, looking beautiful this morning. Thank you. Especially with our homegrown fries. Yep. Our homegrown potatoes frying. I wish you guys could smell this. I noticed they need some eggs in there, so let's go see what we got. Ooh, nice score and tea bags posse. And look, they hide some in there too, in the corner. Woo! Ooh, looks like they gave me a holy chicken squad too. Gotta watch out for that one. Oh. Nice score in Donald's posse too. Look at this delicious meal. Oh my goodness, like 80% of my plate is from the farm. The only thing that's not is that yogurt. We got potatoes, eggs, and cucumbers. Never tried cucumbers for breakfast. No. But I see you've tried it and already eat yours. I did. They're pretty good? They were good. It's okay. Mr. Brown, you're gonna eat yours? Yeah. It's got a little cucumber, a little, his is 100% from the farm. Good job, Mr. Brown. Thank you, Grandma, for helping to make this. You're welcome. There's a ripe pumpkin out in the here in the kitchen garden. There the pumpkin is. Got it. Got it. There's one more pumpkin left. Okay, there the pumpkin is. Got it. Ooh, that's spiny. We found a cherry tomato. There the cherry tomato is. Got it. Just had a good little lunch inside. We don't need much because we have such big breakfast. Now, Jonah put out these mountain bikes. We're gonna try to go on a little ride. Big Daddy and Grandma have left. We're just trying to have a little fun. But first, we gotta see if we can put some air in these tires. That one needs a little bit. That one needs a little bit. I think they all need a little bit. Mom, of course, she's gonna be a stylish woman. She's gotta have a beach cruiser. Isn't that cool? Now, this is the only tire I'm worried about. This one is absolutely gone. I'm afraid that one might be pop, pop. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not fixable. So let's try with that one first to see if a family bike ride is even possible. Good morning. Seems like it's tight holding here. No. Oh. That can't be good. Yeah, it bulged out. I could fix that. But unfortunately, we could see that the, the tube didn't hold. Okay, so I think that back tire, the tube is okay. So let's get that tube off of it and put it on mom's bike. All right, we got mama's uh, tire fixed. Switched it out with the old one. Now we're gonna give it a good wash. Okay, I got mom's bike all beautified, ready to go. We would go now, but it's like 92 degrees. That doesn't sound crazy hot, but with the humidity, it feels like it's about 187. So we're, we're probably gonna go this evening. What do you think, Mr. Brown? You wanna go this evening? First, let's try this bike, just double check. Yippee! It's working great. Back inside, the beautiful one has made chicken broth, and now she's filtering it out. We're just gonna put it in the fridge and eat it, eat it for throughout, lunch. eat it for lunch with our cucumbers, right? Right. 
It is dinner time, and it's no exception. It's food from the land. This time it's spaghetti squash with beef. What else is in here from the farm? Um, it's not our beef, but onions and garlic and spaghetti squash. Sweet. I see you're digging in, buddy. See, he's giving it two thumbs up. Everybody likes it. Beauty has done a piece on this on her channel. We'll link it as soon as that is alive. Okay, we are feeling good after that dinner. And it's much cooler out of here. Hey, what do you think about this bike? I love this bike. You like how we clean, cleaned it up nice for you? Yeah, you're looking stylish on that bike. Having a good time, Mr. Brown? on my bike is I always wanted a beach cruiser and so Justin was driving past this like dinky donk consignment shop and there was this one and he passed it and he thought oh Rebecca would love that bike and he went back and he bought it for me it was only like $15 but it's still a dream fulfilled <laughs> 